This brief video discusses a new sensitivity feature in Neural Tools 6.0. If you ask to automatically test a trained net on randomly selected cases, the test results can depend on the random partition Neural Tools chooses. For example, it might get good test results by selecting a, quote, lucky set of test cases, or it might get unlucky by selecting another set of test cases. Also, it isn't clear what percentage of cases you should set aside for testing. For example, instead of setting aside the default 20% of cases, you might get better results by setting aside 10% or 30% for testing. The testing sensitivity option trains a number of neural nets, each time using a different set of test cases or a different percentage of cases for testing. It can be illustrated with the data set you see here, the auto loan data. You begin by filling out the training dialog box in the usual way. Here, 20% of all cases are set aside for testing. Now I will train. When training is complete, you see this dialog box. The default choice is no, that you don't want to perform the sensitivity analysis. But if you click yes, you see the following dialog box. With the default choices shown here, neural tools will train five times for each of three test case percentages. For example, it will randomly select 10% of the cases for testing, and it will do this five times. Then it will do five times for 20%, then five times for 30%. This can take some time, especially if the MLF or best net search type of net is used. However, it runs fairly quickly with the PNGRN type of net. When all 15 nets have been trained, you see the sensitivity results in both graphical and tabular form. The results themselves will vary from one sensitivity run to another. For the one shown here, you can see, for example, that with 10% of cases set aside for testing, the percentage of bad cases varies from 2% to 10%. The variation for other percentages is somewhat different. Whether this is good news depends on the context. In any case, it does show that the prediction accuracy for test cases does depend, at least to some extent, on the data set set aside for testing.